Well, it's the day where Nidhar Chopra takes on the field again at the Atletisima, the final meet uh, in Luzain. The Diamond League in Luzain, Nidhar Chopra uh, did not get what he wanted in Paris, uh, in the Olympics. He threw really well, 89.34 is a gold medal shot, but uh, Arshad Nadim was too good. Yeah. But how do you see Nidhar Chopra going into this final? I'm actually a little um, worried. Because he himself has said that there is an injury. Mm. Uh, so, I don't know. I mean, if you have an injury, mm. why are you trying to... Um, I mean, of course, he knows better. Probably his uh, physio doctors, they know better. But again, since he said, I'm repeating, he's the one who said that there is a slight injury. Yeah. And uh, if you have an injury, don't you think this might aggravate it? Doesn't it scare you? <laughs> Yes, as you mentioned that he knows better what he is doing. But I think uh, uh, he was... Also, I have a, I have a slight, uh, another question. Yeah. So, do you think, it's a little bit of a, a tough uh, question, but do you think had he got that gold medal? Huh, I was coming to that only. <laughs> do you think he would have uh, participated? Uh, I was coming to that only because uh, in the numerous interviews that he gave after that final in Paris uh, Olympics, he seemed a bit down. Yeah. So, then again, that question comes if it was a goal, whether he would have participated or not. But I think that he is going, uh, he did not get that kick that he wanted from Paris. Right. He was trying, because if you see his throws, other than mm. that 89.34 throw, he was getting there, but he was not getting there, whether or not, whether he was making a throw of 85, 86, he was deliberately, deliberately uh, uh, committing a foul. Yeah. Because he did not want anything less than uh, a gold so he was trying to get there his body might not have been permitting so but if his body was not permitting when uh, he was uh, throwing so i would say might not be no but he himself has yeah. said that there's an injury it's yeah. not you and me yeah, saying yeah. that there's an injury it's him who has said that there's an injury and in fact in one of his interviews recently after mm. the uh, paris olympics uh, I saw he has said that I will go to a doctor hmm. once the season finishes. Ha. So, this is the season finish? Uh, yes, I know. But the entire point is, um, why stretch your season? <laughs> like, why stretch your season? Because while he did not get the gold, it was his season's best. Yeah, it was his season's best. Again, uh, I think athletes at this level uh, want to get that extra bit extra mile I don't know because these are the top level elite athletes I don't we as journalists we as spectators we as fans don't know how the athlete is himself is himself or herself is feeling but I think that uh, reading his expressions while giving the interviews you can he was upset he was uh, clearly he, upset he was not he was happy not with happy. the silver medal and, that and which is a very good uh, thing that you are not uh, happy uh, huh. with well, there, there is another side to it, Rohan, and I'm not asking you to read Neera Chopra's huh. mind. And again, you know, whatever we are discussing is not what we are like stamping on him. Huh. That is how what he might. It is all might be, but yeah. here's there are questions, right? Because it seems uh, like um, he, okay, to me, he seems like he's being. It seems like he's being extremely stubborn, huh. which he doesn't need to be. Because come on, he's Neera Chopra, <laughs> and. Um, you know, why am I concerned about this? Because if this aggravates the injury... Mm, this might create bigger problems in the future. Exactly my point. And while I get it, that he, it, even though it was his season's best, he did not get what he wanted. And a lot of athletes have gone through it, I'm sure. Yeah. And, uh, you know, again, there is one more thing that uh, uh, I want to clarify after this. So there are a lot of people who are, um, you know, talking about how... Um, it's brilliant of Neera Chopra to, you know, uh, participate uh, in in the yeah, Diamond not, League. Not going back and participating, staying back in Europe. Exactly, yeah. exactly. While other athletes are taking a break. So when people are judging others because they are taking a break, <laughs> it should also be, I mean, I genuinely believe, you know, you should also know when to let go. Huh. I feel probably. Probably Neera Chopra could have let go of this Diamond League because this would not have taken anything away from his legacy. The silver, for God's sake, has, does not take anything away from Neera Chopra. So that upset with oneself, I get it. Yeah. 
but what i don't get it is the the stubbornness of participating in the next event even though you are injured all these questions rohan wouldn't have come had you not been injured yes absolutely i i agree with you but again uh, i'm thinking thinking of neeraj's perspective i think he is going for uh, he is not satisfied with himself and that's why he's going had that uh, he, he had won that gold and uh, had that injury he w- wouldn't have participated that that's what i think okay so suppose if he won the gold with 89.34 uh, uh, 34 then he wouldn't have participated no 89.34 is it the throw? Or is it the medal? No, 89.34 and an injury, he wouldn't have participated. 89.34, no injury, maybe he he would have participated. No, no. If there was no injury, we wouldn't have recorded this video at all. We wouldn't be discussing this part. No, I'm saying that gold and injury, then he wouldn't have, what I think, gold, no injury, he would have. Gold, no injury, of course. No injury, no discussion. Yeah, yeah. So basically, no, I, I'm, it's, say, it's, I'm saying whoever have won a gold medals or and went back, I think yeah. that Neeraj wouldn't have gone back if even if he wasn't injured also, he he Got would it. have stayed back and uh, finished the season with with with, with another high point. Absolutely, finish. absolutely. Uh, if, had he not been injured, I'm repeating again, Rohan. Had he not huh. been injured, there's no question of this discussion because of course you will finish the season hmm. if you're not injured. But the question comes because of the injury, and the question comes that. um uh, okay straight up do you think it's a good decision or a bad decision and don't give me diplomatic answers because it's not like we are blaming neeraj chopra for it uh-huh. uh you know i think our viewers should clearly know that uh, he he is a huge neeraj chopra fan i admire neeraj chopra as much as all of you do but as reporters as sports fans also you know these questions come up so do you think it's a correct decision or not first you say and then and then i'll i'll tell uh, you right I think uh, he knows how much intensity is his injury, and given the fact that the main, uh, the next big event is the Asian Games, which mm-hmm. is two years from now. Mm-hmm. I think he knows that he will have enough time to re- uh, get the surgery done, re- re- uh, rehab, and recover for the. He still doesn't know if the surgery is needed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is there. Uh, of course, he is the best judge yeah, so of his he, injury. He will have that two years of gap to. Do, go through the process. I don't think it's two years because uh, Asian Games is twenty twenty six. Yeah, it's one point five years. Uh, yeah, right. roughly one point yeah, five years. Roughly one point five. Um, I get it, but um, well, I don't know how much of a good decision this is. Again, it is completely Neera mm. Chopra's decision. He and his team understands the injury, the extent of the injury, much better than Rohan and I do. Having said that, you know. Uh, Be, being a sports person and myself अगर ऐसा होता ना तो वो इतना पावर ही नहीं करता so um, uh, that day that day he was something else you know because it was he was not getting there so he was cancelling out all the other th- absolutely he, he was determined to be and he uh, repeatedly said this in every interaction uh, be it with us be it with other other media channels he had mentioned that aaj to aa jana chahiye tha kyunki aaj wo lag raha tha ki aa jayega aaj hawa bhi chal raha tha aaj lag raha tha ki aa jayega aaj nahi aaya that's what he was upset with I know, uh, you know, athletes have uh, have that uh, thing that you know. It was my day. Mm. That day, you know, everything is working for you. 
having said that, uh, uh, so I feel that, um, or I at least hope that Neeraj does reach the 90 meter mark because he will end the season on a happy note. That is what is important. No, I, I don't want it to come tonight. I want it to come at Asian Games. Uh, he'll do it again at Asian Games. <laughs> Neeraj Chopra and Kulpit Kulsi <laughs> are synonyms. You know, you go to Google, you search synonyms of consistency and that, that is when they will Oh, on this note, uh, before you finish, you, as you mentioned consistency, uh, we spoke to Adil Sumariwal after the event. He spoke about this one that Neeraj is consistency because every other athlete who have been uh, going for that medal have thrown 90 meters and, have, and, and then again have thrown 84, 83 in other tournaments. But Neeraj has consistently been at the 85 to 88 meter rank. So that's his consistency. Absolutely, and um, that is why that is where the legacy happens. Huh. It's not one medal, two medals, and it is not medals. The legacy is how consistently you perform. You know, um, anyway, uh, well, we have spoken for <laughs> a long time apparently because Neera Chopra is a topic that you can't and not talk debate. about. It was a good debate, but what has Neera Chopra got to say about his own consistency? Uh, you know, we'll end the video with. The man himself, Neeraj, talking about his consistency. And after the video, do like, share and subscribe to Rev Sports. And let us know what you feel about this topic. Absolutely. Do you think, that, that's the exact question. Do you think Neeraj Chopra should have gone for this uh, Diamond League? Or do you think he should have rested again? Mm -hmm. Recruiting for one last time, his team is his own level. But come on, what is sports without debates? So let's debate it out.